Hi guys, welcome back to the Scramble Academy here in Leeds. My name's Chris Collins and I'm from the uh, Neo Shoot Academy in Castleford. Today we're going to go over something a little bit different from the normal playlist. I'm going to go over uh, rear naked choke and in particular the way that we do it at the Neo Shoot Academy, the way we tighten it up and the way that we cinch that uh, choke in. It might be slightly different to the way you've seen it before, that's all. Okay, so we'll bring Liam in here. Liam's paw next going to get some more treatment. <laughs> So we're going to just demonstrate this from this position. Now obviously you know that uh, you'll have seen before that rear naked shots can come from a varied number of positions. But just so that I can show you the way that I tighten the rear naked choke up, I just want him in a nice sort of neutral position here, okay? So from behind my opponent, contact is the key here, alright? So I can't ever do a decent choke or any decent amount of grappling away from an opponent, alright? So with no contact whatsoever, you might as well not call it wrestling. You've got to be nice and close to your opponent, you've got to be touching, you've got to get over that man contact thing. All right? So my hand now is going to slice down, okay? It's going to slice down towards Liam's chest and then back up again, there. Now we go for this slightly different because what I'm going to go for is a sort of semi-choke and a semi-strangle at the same time as well, all right? So I want there my elbow in line with Liam's chin all the time. And you might see this from here, there, and that's more of a choke. The problem is, Liam can turn that way into the crook of my elbow and defend himself like this, okay? So to get round that, I'm gonna go down and round there, and that's a nice tight hold. Straight away, he'll be able to feel the scissor action of my hand grabbing the two veins, the carotid arteries, and his neck there, okay? So I'm gonna down, up, and across there, okay? Next thing I'm gonna do here is grab my bicep. So I bring my hand down, here, very stylized. I won't normally do that in a competition or in a fight because Liam can grab hold of my arm, start putting a, <laughs> an arm lock on there. All right, so I don't want to, do, want to do that. So here, I'm gonna slide it through there, bring it round. There's two ways you can do this. I tend to, because I've got long arms, bring my hand and cup it around the back of his head like I'm giving him a back slap, okay? Um, Steve from Neo Shoot Academy tends to bring his hand up here and make a fist there. Now Steve, uh, Liam, sorry, will find that that pushes his head forwards a lot, a lot more, okay? Straight into the crook of my arm. So there, there, make a fist. It's already tight. Now here, as I said earlier, let's loosen that off while I'm talking. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. <laughs> so here, I need contact. So just this isn't good enough. Just ragging uh, Liam back here is not good enough. It's not gonna make him tap, all right? You might contemplate it, but it won't make a really, uh, you know, in a, a proper fight, no one's gonna tap from that. So I need to get nice and close to my opponent. And the first thing I'm going to do is close down this arm that's gone here. I'm going to get my chin on it, like this. So now if Liam reaches back and tries to uh, capture my hand, he's going to struggle because my chin's in the way. All right? So the next thing that I'm going to do is get nice and close to Liam like I'm whispering in his ear. Okay? This is how you need to remember it. Whispering sweet nothings in his ear. Let me loosen off. There's a big gulp, that. <laughs> All right? So here, I'm going to whisper sweet nothings in Liam's ear. All right? Like this. And then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to make my chest super big here. I'm going to pull back with my arms. So a lot of people think it's all arm strength here, like that. Problem is, you can get very, very tired very, very quick by using all your strength. So let's use technique instead. In, around there, straight away, sorry. Liam. <laughs> In, around there, okay? So you've got that nice crushing action. Now grab my bicep, bring it around. Let's use the fist action there. Get nice and close to Liam. So I'm whispering in his ear. Make my chest big, pull back my shoulders and you get the tap, okay? That's that little bit there, but I also have a few little ways of tightening that up as well. So when I bring this in here, there, I can also put my elbow onto his shoulder. Give him a little bit of pain before I bring it round, okay? That takes his mind off this a little bit, because I'm giving him a little bit of pressure there, okay? Like that, there, 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 and round, okay? Same sort of action, just being a little bit nastier here. Let's be really nasty just before we finish up then. Sorry, Paul, Liam. Why not? Why not? Okay, here, there, there, close. Pull him back, not quite getting it, and stand over the top of my opponent and drive his head with my chest towards his own groin. There, there. And that gets it nice and tight. Tap many people with that one. It's not a very nice joke. See okay. why. <laughs> Thank you, Liam. Did you like what you saw on that video? If you did, Make sure you subscribe, because if you do, you'll see some more playlists of that coach doing some more techniques. Boom!